In our community report, Healthy Savannah is spearheading a program to help underserved residents get important health information. Our Mick Porterfield is live in the studio with us this morning with more on the effort and why the group wanted to start it in the first place. Good morning, Mick. Good morning, Kim. Well, that's right. The program involves training people in leadership positions like pastors or neighborhood leaders about health issues affecting Savannians to be community health advocates or CHAs. Here's a look at some CHAs that have already gone through the training program. Doctors are giving them important information about what they say are the big health issues in our community, like flu and COVID and hypertension and diabetes. Local doctors are worried that fear and misinformation may be stopping people from getting the services they need and hope hearing from a familiar face will help. All of that's going to add a benefit to us individually and collectively to address some of the health disparities, some of the health issues as it relates to diabetes and hypertension and you know all of these thing, chronic diseases that we've been dealing with for years. And so as we can get more people, more individuals, more families, more communities to be conscious of those things, then it's going to change the trajectory of the in entire community. Well, after training, a $500 stipend is given to CHAs for community outreach events. The program has already equipped more than 50 people to be CHAs, and organizers say they're planning to keep expanding the movement. Meg Porterfield, WSAV News 3, on your side. Thank you, Meg. All this week, we've 